Hey everyone, Brandon here with Galloway Precision. Today we are going to go over the installation <coughs> of our redesigned and now 3D printed uh, plus one extension uh, for the Bodyguard 380 series pistols. All right, so first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna go over tools you're gonna need. You're gonna need some blue Loctite, 050 Allen wrench, 1 8 inch punch. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and lock and clear. Visually and physically empty, we're gonna drop our mag, set the pistol off to the side. I'm going to go ahead and open our packaging. And take out your new mag spring and your new extension. I'm going to flip our mag upside down and take our 1 8 inch punch, push it in on the locking plate, and take the base pad off. We're going to take our locking plate off. Now we're going to completely remove our old stock spring. Now when you go to put your new spring in, doesn't matter which end goes in, just make sure that the curl is forward on the last bit of uh, <clears throat> wire there with the flat part facing to the rear. If you put it in this way, the follower is going to tilt wrong, it's going to lock up the mag. Alright, so let's go ahead and put our spring in, put our base plate back, or correction, our locking plate, plate. Blah, 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 blah. need more coffee. All right, now we're gonna take our extension, we'll get it started on there, go ahead and push it all the way on. Now you see, it doesn't always line up. Give it a good pop, locking plate's gonna pop in there. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and take off our locking screw. All right. We're gonna go ahead and Put just a little bit of Loctite. Don't need a lot because uh, the screw does a real good job of biting into the carbon fiber filled nylon. All right. Get it started. I'm going to turn it down. Once you get to the point where you can't really turn it without this part of your uh, L shape hitting the, the mag, you're going to switch to your shorter end. I'm going to tighten it. Right about there. Now, you can see, if you look, you'll see a couple threads sticking through right there. That's what you want, because it's locking up. I don't know how well you're going to be able to see that in the video here. Let me see if I can... Pretty hard to see. But there, you'll see, when you look in here, you'll see a couple threads. And uh, that's what you want, because that locks, locks... I mean, it takes a lot... To push it off that way so it locks it in place and it still is a plus one but five dollars cheaper uh, than what the aluminum ones were all right so here we go and this is normally a six round mag so there's two three four five six seven all right. one two three four five six, seven. Locks in place on a closed slide, and there you are. Now you've just turned your bodyguard into a seven plus one. Seven in the mag, one in the chamber, good to go. Uh, we include the spring in it because it is a uh, increased power spring, so that lock open will still work when you use this extension. And uh, so that's the only thing that's really different uh, from the old, old uh, extension is this one is, you know, we're 3D printing these, so it saves you guys money. Uh, but also this is actually the material we're printing this out of uh, at the thickness we're printing it out of is a little bit stronger, as strong or a little bit stronger than the aluminum we were using. Uh, so lighter weight by and far too. Uh, when it's empty, you can't tell the difference between having this on and having your regular pinky or flat base pad on. So I like it a lot. Uh, it's a lot of people like it a lot, but I figured I needed to go to update the installation video. So the aluminum installation video will be going away, replaced by this. And that's going to wrap it up, guys. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to email me at tech, that's Tango Echo Charlie Hotel at GallowayPrecision.com. Be sure to follow us on social media here on YouTube, like, comment, and subscribe below. 
Be sure to follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Go by the website or Facebook and sign up for the monthly newsletter. That will give you an idea of what the monthly sale is going to be before we tell anybody else about it. You're the first to receive uh, the monthly sale in the newsletter. And that's going to be it, guys. Real short, sweet, uh, to the point video. Uh, if you have any issues, like I said, just shoot me an email. And as always, be safe, be accurate, and God bless.